Hello, and welcome to the first stop on the Huckster Hop. So glad you could join us, and I hope you'll participate in all the sales we have lined up for you today. Here's a list of all of the sales that we're going to be happening today. So right after me at 2.30 at Miss Dam Jewelry, uh, this is all in Eastern time. Three o'clock, we've got Antique Agenda at 3.30, Fat Bird Finds. At four o'clock, we have Sweet Treats and Pretties. At 4.30, Ancestral Beginnings. At uh, five o'clock, Mimi's Treasure Cottage. 5.30, Vintage Uprising, Texas. Six o'clock, Antique Nomad. And 6.30, Trusty Huckster Mercantile himself. So I hope you will pop over to the other sales and check them out and take a good screenshot of that list or you can check it on over on Instagram as well. I've got it posted on, on my Instagram account as well. So who am I? I'm Joni from Vintageous, and uh, you can find out more about me by going to Vintageous.com. On my website, I have links to my Etsy store, my whatnot sales, uh, my Instagram account. So you can find all about me there. And um, yeah, I ship from Canada. So those that are US buyers do be aware that, you know, shipping will take a little longer and have it be about three or four dollars more. I ship without tracking and that keeps the cost down. Um, and so after you buy things from this sale, I will invoice you by Tuesday. And if you pay Wednesday, it ships out Thursday. So without further ado, shall we get looking at the goodies for today? <laughs> so first on my list, I have these super fun, super fun. And if you saw my Instagram, you know what I'm about to show you. Freddie and Frida. <laughs> you can decide who's who. One has golden eyes and the other with these blue eyes. These are incredible and super rare uh, lawn ornaments, really good kitschy old lawn ornaments. They're not marked. Well, actually, wait a minute. This one has a sticker on it. I forgot that. This one says made in Hong Kong. So we know at least where they were made. But I mean, look at those faces. Look at those faces. <laughs> I just love the kind of rhinestone eyes that they have. So, so cool. So, so unique. So these squirrel ornaments, if you're interested in these, $29 for the pair and their letter S. Put letter S in the comments below. Okay, letter S in the comments below. And I'll also put a list of all the things that I'm selling in the uh, description part of this video as well. The next thing I have, I've been wanting one of these for a long time. I've looked and looked and looked, and I finally got a hen on the nest in a cheap enough price that I can offer it to you. And this one is in absolutely mint condition. Really, really good, you know, no chips, no cracks. Really, really good shape. So this is uh, the Indiana um, Carnival Glass. Um, hen, on, hen and egg, hen on basket, I mean, really neat piece, good large size. And this also is $29 and it's the letter C, C for chicken. You'd like, you'd like that hen. <laughs> All right. The next thing I found, oh, I was so excited when I found this too. Look at this one. So this is a, a tea towel, really nice, soft, well, you know, worn in tea towel. And it's a super cute little kitty on a high-heeled shoe. I just thought this was adorable. And it's a nice big one, right? Nice large, large size one, right? Do, 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 do. So, you know, not, not one for, you know, one for a big job. It's got a big job to, to dry. So this cute tea towel, the kitty and shoe tea towel, is uh $12 and it's the letter K for kitten. K for kitten in the comments if you'd like this one. What have I got next? I have some West German ornaments next. So these are marked West German on the top. 
So there are, there's a green one, there's a red one, there is a turquoise one, and there is a yellow one, a gold one, okay? So they say West Germany, I don't know if you'll be able to see it because it's kind of hard to, to, to see it even with a naked eye, but right at the top there, it says West Germany. Now, the one thing that I noticed is this green one doesn't have the top ring. Do you see that? So that's the only thing that I'll point out. I mean, they are a bit shabby. They've got, you know, the little bit of um, scratching and little pitting and stuff because what you'd expect to find from really old mercury glass balls. So these Christmas balls, the West German Christmas balls, $15 for the set of four. And it's the letter O for ornaments. O for ornaments. You throw that in the chat. They're coming home to you. Okay, what have I got next? I have a really cute little lot of three pieces. So you'll get this little Santa. And he, he you know, he's cute. He's small, like you, you can see from the size of my hand. He's, I'm going to guess he's like three inches. Let me just check here. But I'm going to guess. Three and a half. I was close. Three and a half inches tall. Okay. Now he, I think he's a crafter's piece. There's no marking on the bottom. I think somebody did paint him, but I think he, they, he was painted in the fifties. Often you find these ones with the kind of like they're opalescent. Do you see how it's kind of got that opalescent sheen on his bag? And it could have been a pin cushion. You could certainly make it into a pin cushion or it could be cute for kit, little candy canes or um, toothpicks. I mean, you could do a, Cheese sticks, I think somebody, somebody says. Little air plant. I mean, whatever, whatever your little heart desires. So that's one piece of the lot. So there's this piece. Then there's a round glass chandelier crystal and a old uh, mercury glass ball. So this set of the three items, all three of them, um, $12, $12. And it's the letter B, the letter B, if you'd like this lot. Lot of goodies. Okay. Then I have two Fiesta mugs. So I've got a yellow one and I've got a green one. Now these are the newer ones, so you don't have to worry about lead or anything like that. Uh, so that's the marking on the bottom. So these two fun Fiesta mugs, green and yellow, $15 for the pair, smoke and deal, letter F for Fiesta. F for Fiesta, if you'd like your coffee and something, something fun and colorful. All right. How about we look at, oops, don't want that mug to fall. Let me, let me fix that. <laughs> the next thing I have is a set of swizzle sticks that are cacti. Aren't these fun? So two of them, well, like, well this one has an or orange little tips. Then there's one with red tips and then there's one with yellow tips. So just so you know, they've got a little bit of different coloring on them. And you can see if I hold it up closer there. So really fun little swizzle sticks. This set of three cacti Swizzle sticks is $12 and it's the letter G for glass because they are glass. The letter G. All right. Then I have a really beautiful piece of Navajo pottery. So this has been obviously hand done, right? Really neat piece. It's really striking. Um, it has, it is signed and the original price sticker on there is on there. So it was signed Cheryl and that's also says Navajo and originally it costs $24.95. That's what I paid. Um, so really collectible Navajo cedar Mesa pottery, $26, the letter N. $26 
the letter N for this gorgeous, gorgeous vase. Really neat. I love the ombre. Right? Okay, so that's that. Then I have these really neat silver plated candlesticks. And Nate, if you're watching, you'll be very pleased to know that I got these from a thrift shop store that likes to polish their silver. So every silver thing you find there is highly polished. So these have been polished, but they're really, I like them. They're lightweight because they don't have, you know, they're hollow, right? Um, they're marked, it says um, W W A Rogers, made in Canada, silver plated copper, SP copper, right? Really neat, nice lightweight ones, really fun. So these, this, these uh, set of, and when these look amazing with, um, Lucite candles with the like silver flecks. Wouldn't those look amazing? Okay, so these are silver silver plated candlesticks, fifteen dollars. The letter P, the letter P for plated. Letter P. Oh, now this is one of my favorite pieces. I love this. Then I love little little vases. I think this is something that I could easily collect. So this is a little Pukeberg. And you can see the, the um, label on there. It still has its original label. Pukeberg, Sweden. Very, very collectible little Scandi vase. Small guy, right? Let's see what size he is. He is three inches high. Now this is very, very well, Burn me very very well made and you can see that it has flecks of red yellow orange really pretty little vase very very well made okay so this little scandy vase is 26 dollars and it's the letter y for yellow 26 dollars and the letter y if you'd like to add to your Scandi collection, or you like sort of mid-century um, glass. Then I have something kind of different. I have a bunch of game pieces that I thought would be really cute for crafting. Whoa! <laughs> uh, really different ones. Like so This is like a dice with different... I'm not sure what game that was from. Um, there's a little bit of dominoes, there's some Scrabble letters, there's little men, all sorts of things. So a little, you know, little Jack. Oh, and there's even a Smurf with a, on a suction cup and a little marble. Oh, and this little cute card, look at this card. So tiny, little playing card. Okay, so this box of assorted game bits for crafting, $9, $9 and the letter M, the letter M for men. Like there's little men. Okay, so that's the, the next one. Um, all right, moving right along, I've got some earrings. Now these are real jade stones on the on here, but these are gold tone earrings. I could not see a marking that they were gold. Um, so they are gold tone, but real jade. Really neat dangly earrings with kind of a you know really interesting little metal piece and some chain. So this pair of Jade and gold tone earrings, $12, $12, and the letter J for jade, J for jade, if you like dangly earrings. Then I have a piece of lucite. I love this piece. Look at this one. Oh, I just love lucite. I don't know. It's one of my things for sure. So it's got little red, uh, yellow roses. Hold it up this way, little yellow roses, and then the back of it is kind of green, I guess, to set off the you know the yellow roses. It's a teardrop shape, it's on quite a short chain. Um, you could you could change the chain, I suppose, 
um, it is 16 inches, a 16 inch chain. So really quite a short chain, a really neat piece. Definitely mid-century. So this uh, Lucite pendant with the yellow roses is $18, $18, and it's the letter L for Lucite. The letter L for Lucite. <clears throat> then I have a pair of hummingbird earrings. Hummingbird earrings. I thought these were really fun. If you like hummingbirds, you'll love these. So they've got a little bit of bling a bling bling, a bling a bling bling on them. I'm going to take one off just so that I can show it to you up close. Yeah, so you know, kind of some bling on there, some blue enamel, very cute. And here's the back of it as well, sort of textured metal. So these hummingbird earrings. Are fifteen dollars one five fifteen, and they are the letter H for hummingbird. H for hummingbird. Great little gift for someone that loves hummingbirds, right? I love hummingbirds, but I don't have pierced ears, <laughs> so they need a new home. All right, and then I have. A really cool thing. Oh, no, forget that. I got to do something else. I've got a set of Art Deco, Bakelite, and Chrome. And these are cool. They are insulated egg cups. So they would keep the egg warm. So that's that one. And I'll show you inside this one as well. Um, really neat. You see a lot of English teacups or teapots, um, cream and sugar is kind of like these as well. So these are uh, the set of two, $18, the letter D for Art Deco. D for Deco, if you like these cool egg cups. And then to kick things off and to make things fun and exciting, I have a giveaway. This amazing brooch, have a look at this gorgeous, gorgeous filigree check glass brooch. Just stunning color. It's like a sapphire blue. I think it's just beautiful. And here's what ha here's who can uh, get this giveaway. So it goes to the first person who comments that they bought three things. One thing from me and two things from other sellers in the shop, in the sale. So if you go and buy two things from two other people and something from me, you can come, come to the comments. Let me know who you bought for, what you bought. And you're, if you're the first one to comment with those three things, this brooch is going to be added to your order. How's that? Would you like that? I think it's gorgeous. Just stunning check glass brooch. Really, really pretty. That's all there is. So thank you so much for coming to this stop on the Huckster Hop. I hope you'll hop on over now to Miss Dam Jewelry because she's coming up right at 2.30, uh, 2.30 Eastern that is. And I'll be having my next live sale on Tuesday, September 6th at 6 p.m. with well, the one and only Pam Blanchard. Shoot, Bob Fuzzy, I'm so excited about that. <laughs> I hope to see you there. Thank you again for joining me. You know I love ya. Mwah. Take care and hop on over to Miss Dan. Bye now. <laughs>